Alright, we're back to finish this game. Basically. So here is going to go ahead and buy out Valka for 3 out of 5. And yeah, it just hurt my stock. Bowser is going to punish Peach for not investing in her other shops. Yeah, take her down the peg. I mean, well, she can still invest in the other two shops. And he's just going to sell most of his stock in my area, which is the usual. And you can do a buyout. Nah, she doesn't say no, save her money. Still so can go ahead and most likely save her card by going getting a dime going into the diamond line. And she's gonna give someone stocks in my district, because it's the most valuable. She's gonna give it to Bowser. And, and Bowser's gonna get 83. And he's gonna move everyone around the map. So Peach is gonna not get any suit. I'm gonna be back at start. And Stella, so will she. So we'll see, Peach gets a chance to buy stock, she's going to pick more in her 3 out of 6, and she's actually going to say no to invest. And she wants to save up, in the, she wants to save up her stocks. I'll go ahead and go down here to, to change a club, maybe. Also here gets the most likely buy stock back in my area. Plus the 20 free stock he got. A break for Peach. Club. So now I need a diamond and spade. And this time Stella's gonna be greedy for the boom. And not save her suit. Well, her suit yourself. Thank <laughs> you. 
I need a... Well... I might as well go ahead and get, go to the boon and get a diamond so that way I can just buy more stock in my 4 out of 6 and then invest. And Bowser is gonna actually not go to the heart line. That's weird. Does the change to a spade or heart? Oh, what? Well, either way, he's really great. Decides to go for a serpent drone. In which he actually wins. Okay, well, the chase is a is a spade, which is gonna be a heart. So I mean, well, I'm not sure why he's gonna risk it for that twenty five forty four shot though. For Stella, gives her a chance to free a little me more. Just constantly boosting the stock value at this point. Until I get the chance to invest, and. Well, Bowser gets lucky to jump over Peach's shop. Also, boost the tail in front of her. stock in my area. That's straight up to the area itself. At this point, if I get the chance to invest, then... Yeah, then Peach is probably gonna get fourth again, actually, and the rankings are gonna change. Since the Bowser Stellar are just going to keep buying stock in my area. And if he's going to buy 15 and 8. Avoiding Peach's giant shop. Here's my chance to invest in the last, the one shop I have invested in. Which is the biggest shop in the, in the district.
then yeah, no surprise. Buy at least 10 or buy like 10 to 20 stock to freeload to just keep boosting first place the stock price. And yeah, now Peach is in last. Then maybe round of bucks will give her sevens because she's in last. Well, no, instead she gets stock in my area, which technically, I mean, that's a lot. That's free money. Yeah, twenty-five stocks. Yeah, look, <laughs> look at that boost you just got. And this is gonna be the goal for me. Okay, it goes up to 87 either way, so. So yeah, I was gonna order Bowser Call to make him in his own castle. Which Bowser is in mind, since he's being ordered by Peach to do so. Now, since I have the goal, and since Peach. Has stock in my area, I'm gonna avoid her cell 10 on me. And I start being smart to invest in the weaker shops. Not that it matters. those on the bank too. And so in the end, um, I think the rankings did not change actually. I believe I recall Stella was in third after I ended the first part, the first part of this game. And then Peach still got second because of the 25 stocks in C. And Bowser still got last. Which should have been or should have happened last game, but you know, at least this time he didn't get third second, he got fourth from winning last time and like making me not clear. So we get the bronze property and the gold stocks. And everyone else gets bronze stocks and bronze property for Peach. And we just get the bronze piggyback prize. Which I'm not sure how like free when did I free load? Interesting. Oh well. Actually, I guess the piggyback was for the five stock in Peach's area, I guess. I think that's why. So it's the 58 turns. So it was quicker than last time. But it was more like the fact that last game everyone had something going for them now. This one was more all about everyone freeload me except for Peach, really. And I just really, yeah, I realized no one made a big payment in this one. Nor did the last one, actually. Except, I think last game, everyone was at least above halfway except for Peach. Well, the halfway mark except for Peach last game. But this time, only Peach made it halfway. But uh, with that, that's gonna be Dawson's Castle. It's gonna be one down, three more to go. So the tip for this time is gonna be you know, keep your orientation of your Wii more comfortable. So we're gonna unlock Good Egg Galaxy, which is in fact actually the biggest map for the Mario series in Fortnite Street Wii for standard. And also, I think for easy rolls too. Go figure. Yeah, the last map for the Mario series in Fortune Street Wii is the biggest one. 
But with the opponents, though, it's going to be easier since it's going to be two C ranks and only one threatening high rank player, the S rank Jessica. But the map, though, is going to be harder. I mean, even got it's even got an island to the right, even though it's a former straight line. But it'll all be seen next time. Till then, see ya.